it comes to having nails i'm the worst i'm the worst i'm the worst because when they start to get too long i start picking i start picking and that's when i get myself in trouble and i have a little boo-boo on my hand i won't show you too much because it i did listen i ripped my nail off i ripped it off oh good though i, I did clean it off i just need to put a band-aid on it and guess who didn't have band-aids at home band selection is very important based off of where you're sticking it on your body mine happens to be my fingers so we're gonna need something heavy duty i could go with the flexible fabric band-aids but after a while these things get like stringy when avocados get like that stringy stuff in them oh yeah that's exactly what these band-aids are <laughs> if i just ruined avocados for you i'm really sorry Sorry. I'm thinking more or less so we do a heavy waterproof band-aid. I could go with a nice sheer band-aid. This one says it covers, protects, and blends with the skin, which honestly, I'm gonna wear a band-aid. I want everybody to know, okay? I want the attention on me. I want everyone to know I have a boo-boo. It's a great icebreaker conversation starter. Also, don't need pads. My finger is relatively small. I mean, relatively. You get the advanced healing hydro seal band-aid. These band-aids are just cool, okay? And they come in a shiny package, which is very, um, okay, a big selling point for me. Who knew there were so many options for band-aids? Like, it's very overwhelming if you really think about it.